What's up, beautiful people? So we're about to head up to this building. We heard they had some very good Indian food here. So we're gonna try some good Indian dishes. Yes. That's right, family. We got the beautiful family with us today. Yes, we walked a good 20 minutes just now. Yeah. 20 minutes. Yeah, yeah. Yep. a good 20 minutes. So that's good. Yeah. Get the heart rate going a little bit. Yeah. Mess around and, uh, you know, get ready to eat. We ain't eat all day, so this is First this is meal. beautiful, yeah. Yep. Yeah, yeah. And you know what time it is, family. We the unapologetic. No mans, and we unapologetically. No matter. Yeah. Yeah, so we just uh, go up here, I believe. All right, so we have got to uh, catch the elevator. Mm -hmm. All right, so we're waiting, I believe. We go to the top. Oh, the sign, okay, so this is where we're gonna be going to the paparazzi restaurant and bar. Beautiful people. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so, looks like the elevator is, uh... Right. Okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> That's gonna be extra if you gotta take the steps. I know. Yeah. I'm already a little, like, tired. I need a nap. So, uh, good workout, though, ladies and gentlemen. You know, you go on a good walk. I'm going to go into my dance. <laughs> <Why>? <laughs> so, you know, I have to get that exercise in. Here. Yeah. Okay. I guess so. I'm thinking it's probably. That must not work. Mm -hmm. You look worried if it's not coming down. He did. It's not good, but it's hot. It must not work. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Are you sure you got to stare at it? It's probably someone just standing in a, in a uh... On their phone, on TikTok. When we get TikToks, because nowadays these children... Yeah. <laughs> like they purposely holding the door closed so they can make a TikTok or something. Yeah, which we don't understand. Oh yeah. Well, if you don't know, children will go in the most random places and make TikToks. I've seen multiple people make dancing TikToks in the elevator, which is dangerous because it could like... You're not supposed to do that. Huh. But yeah, so let me hold you it. Might have to catch the steps, y'all. Catch the this steps. This is not working. Mm. Yeah, this is not working. Mm. So, uh. That's when we get to the day. Yeah, see, I guess since we're going our little last workout. Yeah. I guess. All right, so. The elevator right. is dead. Yeah. Did not come down. So we got to catch the steps. Yeah. 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 You can't complain about not working out, even though it's your second time working out. It's a bad one. Let me get over here and it's cold. Yeah, it's a real nice view up here. As you can see, you can see all of our booze and burr. Oh, you can see all the booze and burr here. Over here you have the lake. Then you have the beautiful city. Yeah, as you can see, you got the beautiful mountains out there, you mirror. Yeah, and you have people here who like to uh, take pictures and video. <laughs> yeah. Look at this, this is a beautiful sight over here. Yeah, <laughs> you have the mountains right behind, the beautiful lady, and the things of that nature. All right, we can see what's happening going to sit on. This is a nice restaurant. Yeah, the ambience is nice. Everything is, is just pretty nice. You wanna see what the other side look like? Okay, I think we should sit on this side. This is real nice over here. Look at that, very nice. Yeah. Oh. All right, so that's the restaurant family. Nice restaurant. 
so we have the menu. We have the menus to get something to eat. Yes. I'm now gonna be sweet the rest of the day after this. Cool, I guess. So uh we are at an Indian restaurant right now. We love Indian food. Yes. Traveling to places like uh the UAE, um Cambodia and places like this, they have a variety of Indian foods. Even out here in Africa, they have a lot of Indian food places. Um, uh, with the times on, you had Indian food places you could eat at. Yeah, Very good, good ones. Too. Yeah, good ones. Good ones. Um, Rwanda has some Indian food places here. And we're going to try it here and see how it is. And we're going to let y'all know how it is, family. That's right. And we're at the Paparazzi restaurant and bar. Yeah. Yeah, beautiful people. So we had to uh, change seats because that breeze was a little too much for me. We will be sweating and things. I don't want to get sick. Okay. Oh, daddy, we got our favorite. You have mutton. Watermelon juice. Getting chicken tikka. I mean, mutton masala. Heck no. Yeah. We've explained this in the past. I don't know what it is. It's with your dad's system. Mutton be real tasty. But when we eat it. Yeah, it's okay. But like when me and him eat mutton, I don't know what it is. I don't know if we feel the, the sadness of the poor animal that had to get, you know, taken out <laughs> for the eatage. But we be feeling so depressed when we after yeah. we eat it. We just yeah. be sitting there like, yeah, yeah we be in the bed curled up in the ball. Yeah. <laughs> like yeah. mom be having a probably kind of uh thing. uh uh. uh had his back as he cried, yeah. and I just be in my room. Like, I got a cry in her bosom, <laughs> and it's like shake uncontrollably after I eat mutton. For some reason. <laughs> I can't. Yeah. Shot. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is such a nice uh, view. Yeah, this is better lighting too, Ava. You see your little dimple. Look at that. Yeah. Did you show you to get? Uh, yeah, they got chili chicken. Karma. Oh yeah, you see that. Yeah, chroma, chroma. No, chroma, chicken. Chroma. Oh, hmm. What you get? Probably the chicken tikka masala. Oh, hey, no, 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 no. This one. Um, you. Let me see something now. Yes, Indian butter chicken with rice. Chicken. Oh. All right, so what you get? So I want to try this. Spring rolls, I haven't had them in a while. They have the vegetable spring rolls with sweet chili sauce. Uh, you could get the veggie ones, chicken or shrimp. I think maybe veggie or chicken. Okay. Or they have samosas, uh, the beef samosas. Yeah, and things. Um, try chicken tikka. Um, mm -hmm. Small spice, yeah. Yes. <laughs> so this is a sound to. So, yeah, beautiful people. So we are at Papa Rossi Restaurant. Peace and love to the beautiful family. I'm gonna show y'all what we have on the menu. I'm gonna just glance through it so y'all can see real quick. Okay, so uh, let me start at the beginning. Yeah, this is Papa Rossi, as you can see. Yeah, restaurant and bar. This is actually the food menu, not the drink. Uh, yeah, so. Appetizer, spring rolls, you got uh, fried calamari tartar sauce, chili chicken, vegetable Manchurian, you got tandoori uh, chicken, chicken, half chicken, chicken tikka, you got uh, paparazzi, you got Caesar salads here, look at that. You got chicken, scrumps, you got uh, avocado salad, yeah. Um, here's soups, tomato soup, chicken soup. Uh, you got pasta, spaghetti with garlic and olive oil, that sounds very good. You got stir fried noodles, vegetables, chicken beef. You got chicken, pule, roti, flavorful chicken, fajita, Indian butter chicken, methi chicken. Yeah, you got a uh, chicken tikka masala, which is my favorite. This is what I'm gonna try right here. Yeah, this is what I'm gonna try right here. Yeah. All right, so over here you got beef. If you like the beef person, I know my wife loves beef. I'm not a beef person. <laughs> okay, I don't eat a lot of beef. All right. I like my beef in Burgers, they say it's brown, they like brown beef, um, samosas, yeah. Right. So you don't eat beef, but you do like lean meat no, paws. Like All right, so uh, you got uh, a filet de beef, you got your steak, cordon bleu, you got the curry beef still, you got uh, disturbed uh, fried beef, 
and then we got even we got a lamb. We got some lamb, Ayla. Not Mary had one. Okay. So uh yeah, you got the mutton jow frazy, which is Ayla's favorite. You got the mutton masala, you got the uh rugue uh de chef. Um and then you got fish. Look, you got the fish and chips, you got grilled Saint Gala said with peas. I mean with sauce, protocol. You got oven roasted capitan filet with minette sauce. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Guan fish. I don't know what guan fish curry is. We might have to try that one day, uh, Boom Baby. As long as it has no tomatoes. Yeah. I can't eat a lot of dishes that have tomatoes, so I'm going to try the chicken tikka. The chicken tikka is like marinated chicken, uh, and it, it's, uh, it's got this yogurt sauce mixed in there. Yogurt sauce, so yeah. And since we're at the restaurant, you gotta try some of their food. Definitely. Definitely, you got to try the Indian food since we're at an Indian restaurant. We're not like Ayla who goes to burger places and tries chicken. <laughs> Or I go to a pizza restaurant and get pasta. Yeah. Oh no, you get something like a burger. We'll go to a burger place, you get chicken. We'll go to a pizza place, you get a burger. Yeah, and it's a pasta place and I get pizza. Yeah. That's cool. Exactly. Thank you. Thank you. You got a good uh, waiter here. Yeah. Thank you. It's cold. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, it feels like around 34 degrees Fahrenheit. Maybe 35 degrees Fahrenheit, so that's a very good temperature. Family, this is fresh watermelon juice. I can still see some of the specks of watermelon, but it's it's very cold. Let's see you take a uh, drink. Ice. Mm. Oh, that's nice. Very cold, sweet. That was a good watermelon. Yeah. yeah. Does it remind you of uh, down south? Yes. Yeah. That's our thing. We used to wait for the watermelon season and cut one up and put it in. I love putting it in the fridge. That's my mom's thing. Yes. She put it in the fridge, make it just chill, get it chill. Yeah, I yes. love it. All right. So we have uh, also fish. No, I'm playing. I'm playing. <laughs> yeah, but anyway, we have. Uh, yeah, I'm going to just go through the menu so people can see what we have here because it's, you know. Um, vegetarian blend. Okay, so for the vegans who come here, you even have the uh, portion of the menu that is dedicated to you. You have the uh, the Kadai paneer, which is Indian cottage cheese and bell peppers, and cooked spicy masala. The um, Kadai paneer. Yeah. Vegetarian. This is vegetarian. Yeah. Um, you got the palak paneer, cottage cheese cubes, and a mild spiced smooth spinach sauce. Oh, that's, that don't sound bad. Yeah. And you had the tikka masala, which I believe that masala, I believe, has to deal with tomatoes. Yeah. You got the dal makani, cream, lentils, slow cooked, and flavored with rich blend of herbs and spices. That sounds good. I actually had this. Remember, I used to get this when we was in the UAE. Um, it had the lentils, the dal makani. It has the lentil. Yeah, I think I had that. It's almost, not quite soup, but it's a lot of lentils in there. It's like a mashed kind of, it's good. The spices are good. Yeah, it was good in there. Yeah, I like that one, and I like the uh, one they had with the um, chickpeas, too. Yeah, I used to love that one. Oh, that I used yeah, to get, yeah, always yeah. get that. Yeah. Chili now? Yeah. See, you want to move back here now, don't you? Yeah, I told you it was going to get cool. I was freezing over there. It was hot, right? And so I was like, yeah, this breeze is nice. Yeah. And now that I have like cooled it down, yeah. I'm cold. Yeah. All right. So we have uh, Paparazzi Classic Burgers. All right. So if you want to come to the Indian restaurant Paparazzi and get a burger, hey, that's up to you, family. They probably still good, though. I don't know. Um, they got beef, chicken, and vegetable burgers. So if, if you're a uh, vegan, the vegetable burger is probably your choice of uh, food that you want. Um, we got homemade paparazzi pizzas, the margarita, the paparazzi special chicken pizza, homemade uh, paneer pizza, tuna and onion pizza. Eh? All right. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. We got the uh, croquet madame 
piece of sugar, crispy french fries, huh? Oh, that's enough of the menu. I was trying to let, give the people, see what I want to do. Yeah, but I want to show them the menu so that they can see the, oh, they got that, oh, I got to go there, yeah. You got different brochettes, beef, chicken, fish, you got uh, rice specialties. You got, you know, when you come to the Indian spots, you got to have the, uh, the, the biryani family. That's what Indian food's all about, biryani. Is that right, Boom Baby? That's right. Staple dishes. Yeah. Not Staples. Yeah. Not, not Staples, the store. I miss yeah. Staples. That was a nice store. Yeah, they had a lot of uh, school, school stuff. Shopping. Yeah. School shopping was fun because of Staples. Yeah. So we uh, did a lot of walking this morning and uh, it was worth it because this view is it's beautiful. It's beautiful. And um, the atmosphere is chill. It's nice. It's breezy. Very chill. Mm. Yeah. Move back here where there's no problem. <laughs> But I'm gonna finish this up. I'm almost finished. You got the naan bread, garlic naan, the butter naan, and then my wife's favorite part, the desserts. You got the homemade pancakes with a choice of condiments, chocolate, honey, icing, sugar. You got the gulab jamun. You got the gajar ka halwa. You got the ice cream, vanilla, strawberry, chocolate. And you got a summer fruit salad. Thank you. And that is the menu. They got a bar menu, but I'm not gonna go into that because the wife does not want me to spoil everything for the people who want to come to paparazzi and eat. <laughs> yeah, but the bar menu is pretty, you know, standard most places, so you know they're gonna have drinks. So that's good enough, you know. Yeah, yeah, but they have a, a big menu, so. At least they have something I can eat because I know a lot of you just have uh, tomatoes in there, but. They still have a lot of dishes that I can, I can eat. Yeah. I like so family, um, I'm trying to decide if we're going to stay here or move back to where it's uh, Z Ayla's cold. Y'all was making fun of me when I said it's too breezy. It's cold now. Yeah. So we'll be back when the food gets close, family. All right. It's here. Oh man, that's the butter chicken. That looks very lovely. Okay, chicken tikka masala. Yeah, that's what I got. Yeah, that looks good too. Okay, so we have the chicken tikka. Oh, event. Nice. Spicy sauce and yogurt. Yogurt sauce, right? Yogurt and veggies. Got some samosas. Chili sauce. Oh yeah, that looks good. Thank you. And that is the uh, cheese naan. Yeah, we got cheese naan. Samosas. This looks good. It looks delicious. Please let me know how those samosas are. This is sweet chili sauce. This is not ketchup. <laughs> sweet chili. Yeah, that's Mmm. Oh! 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 These are good! <laughs> no, they, they bad, they bad. Yeah. Look, I, don't, I don't like these. Yeah. I don't like these. Yeah. <laughs> I don't like these. Yes, yeah, so you want me to eat them? Yeah. Mmm. Yeah. Mmm. Nice. Thank you. Woo! Thank you. Thank mm. you. I got garlic and butter naan. Mmm. Uh. I'm, let me try one of these. It's just sweet chili sauce. Because I always had a camera and y'all eating and then the stuff be cold or gone. <laughs> or gone. Mm. Yeah, beautiful people. So uh, everything looks delicious. Everything smells delicious. Just the aroma is delicious. Yeah. So I'm going to try it first. And this is sweet chili sauce. Mm, yes, it is. is it like... That's, that's sweet chili mm. sauce. Mmm. <laughs> Hey, you don't want those. You don't want those. <laughs> yeah, they, I don't know. They, this is an adult dish. <laughs> yeah. Because it tastes, oh my goodness. You know what? I'm this. I'm not lying. I'm not hyping nothing up. I'm not hyping nothing up. No cap. Matter of fact, I'm, I'm, I'm going to expose the Uncle Phil. I got to expose the Uncle Phil on this. 
this is the best samosa that I've had that I could think of, family. And I had some good samosas. This is the best one I've ever had. No. No lie. No cap. You saw the Uncle Phil, family. Straight up and down. That's samosa. That, that, that I can't even say it right. <laughs> That's some right there. We need to meet the chef. Yeah. That's oh, ignorant. Man. Okay, that done trumped all the samosas I've had. And I've yeah. had some really good ones. Really good. Wow. I'm gonna have to order some more. Those things are crazy. What? Let's get something to go. Very good. Mm. Mm. Oh. Very good. It's okay. Open, but don't pour. Yeah, thank you. Dums is good. Baby. Dums is good. Yeah. Baby. The flavor yeah. and that sweet chili sauce is really good. Yeah. Yeah. Mmm. Gonna have to get some to go. It's important to have samosas with chili sauce. A lot of times you get samosas and there ain't no chili sauce. Yeah. So they got the chili sauce. Ooh. Man. Mm. So That's what is fire? Yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah. Even the salad. Mm. Salad's good. Yes. Mm. You don't want that. I'll take that one. <coughs> How you gonna have two? Mm. <laughs> uh, it's tasty. I'm gonna taste it, hold on. Got cucumber, and some carrots. Mmm. Okay. Now we need to win. <laughs> Mmm. Mm. Ain't that deep? Simple. It's cheesing mm. real good. Mm. It tastes like it got some sage or some cumin in there. Definitely salt and pepper. And it's something else. It's good. Mm. Mm. It's good. Salad's all that. Mm. Yeah, they got good side salads out here. Here. Jen. I'm gonna get them to do a little dance in uh, Tika with the. <clears throat> It's a slight spice, spiciness going on in the yogurt sauce. Very tender. That's love right there. That's good. Mmm. Mm. Mm. Yes. You want to taste it? A little yeah, piece. Yeah, a nice. little piece. Let me try that. A little piece. Let me take that. <laughs> mm. I like the flavors. It got a tad bit of bite to it. Mm -hmm. That's real good. Mm -hmm. Like right you over here. Mm. As you can see, cheese naan. Mm. Yeah. And I got the chicken tikka masala. Now, chicken tikka masala is the dish I always get when I go to a, an Indian restaurant. That's my favorite dish. It's tomatoes, chicken, and a lot of Indian spices and things. Yeah. So I'ma just do mine like this, make like a, a chicken tikka masala, cheese naan taco. Yeah. Mm. Hey, look, you got to try this. Mm. Your mama can't eat tomatoes. You got to try this. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Mm. 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 I went out. Commence on the triage. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, yes, no. because I don't even taste any of it. Oh, I gotta go to some more.
Right, we gonna have to make this a series. The best Indian series. We gonna have an Indian series. I'm about to shout this the best Indian restaurant without even tasting anything else. God, y'all don't know. Indian food is up there in our top five favorite cuisines. You know, so because they seasoning and the use of butter and seasonings and the spices, they know what they're doing. They know what they're doing. Facts. They know what they're doing. Oh yeah, this is yours. Okay. I gotta take some wine. Now I have garlic now. That cheese is good too. Sure. I have butter. Um, I forgot, but it's butter chicken. chicken. <laughs> It's butter chicken. Oh, let me get a good view. Let me get a closer. Now this don't. I don't think oh, butter chicken has tomatoes. Goodness, that looks good. That looks so good. Yes. Butter I chicken mean, might I not have tomatoes. <laughs> I don't think. If you taste the dish, you like you would be really upset. All right. Let's taste. Mmm. Mm. Wow. You have a different one. It's different. Yeah, it's butter chicken. It's good. Wow. That's good too. And I asked for spice, That's and they gave it spice. That's what I'm saying. I don't think they got to make them. Oh, yeah. wow. That's good. The garlic naan, buttery and garlicky. Mm, yes, that spice is just yeah. right. Mmm. Mm. Mm. Jealous just watching you bite that. Yeah. <laughs> I can't even. <laughs> it's got tomato. But this right here, this is just. This is chicken breast. Mm -hmm. It is so tender. It's still juicy. Mm -hmm. See, they, not everybody can cook chicken That's breast. Right. It's they still juicy. It's yeah. still juicy, yeah. Mmm, you got Mmm, mm, look at that. Mm. No struggle, it just comes off the end. That was tender. But yeah, so everybody, um, yeah, beautiful people. So what we gonna do, we gonna eat so we can, um, we'll tell y'all what the deal is after we eat and everything and um, let y'all know how everything tastes and things like that. We already let you know how it tastes, but we gotta eat. I'm hungry, um, we'll be back, family. All right, so as you can see, we ran through everything, family. Give give it up for Mickey for uh, clearing this plate out. Yeah, <laughs> look at your plate. I only had one samosa. Only me? I only had one samosa, and I had zero of the salad. <laughs> look at this plate. Huh. Oh my goodness. A mess, I know. What's up with this? You look like you still got some left. I'm kind of full. She had all that nine. That, that nine is empty. I had one and I had two drinks, and I'm so thirsty. So how was everything? <laughs> that food was good. That really, that moved another tier up in my top favorite food list. Mm. Mm. So what's your top five favorite foods? First, we got, of course, soul food. That's always going to be the top. And then after that... Mm. Uh, Korean kimchi? No. <laughs> no, we don't even know a face. Like, like they have good dishes, but that's not my top five. Um, I'm gonna have to go to American Chinese. Wait, soul food. Okay, here's soul food in Jamaican. Yes. That's in one. That's kind of in the same sort of section. That's got to be in the same time. That's the number one section. Okay. Soul food in Jamaican is like. Yeah, that Caribbean. Yeah, that Caribbean. That Caribbean food is something. <laughs> anyway, right, so, that's so that's, and then comes uh, American Chinese, and then Indian. Uh, okay. So that's probably top three. Okay. That's, that's the third. Because you said four, but okay. I did. You said soul food, uh, Jamaican. And American Chinese. Oh, that's the four. American Chinese and Indian. And what's last on your list? What's number five? Number five. Ethiopian. That's mothers. That is mother. <laughs> um, I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna have to say that's a rough one. What would be the fifth? Mm, maybe Thai. You got the spring rolls, the fried, the noodles, the rice. Probably Thai. So lovely wife. How was the food? <sighs> this food was magnificent. It was magnificent. It was very good. Very good. Oh my goodness. Your plate, 
uh, the appetizer plate, everything. Some of Ayla's uh, nine brand. I had a little piece of nine. I like nine, so yeah. She didn't have a lot, like, because she only had a little bit of chicken. Like, you didn't have, like, big pot or nothing, so. Mm. So what are your top five dishes? Oh, my goodness. Cuisine, Cuisine yeah. Cuisine from different cultures. Uh, uh, I'm going to have to go with... Uh, I don't want to put these in order. Because, mm. you know, the order changes sometimes based on I where you eat. Just now. So I'm going to go with... Uh, in no order, again, because somebody's not listening. Um, <laughs> definitely soul food. Yeah. That's the food I grew up on. That's back home. Yes, that's, that's always, always going to be one of my favorites. Um, I also love, uh, of course, Caribbean food. Yes. Um, I, I also like uh, definitely Indian food. Indian food. Yes. Thai. It's Thai, Thai. The way they do is spices and seasons. Oh my goodness, Thai. And then I'm going to have to put sugar. I'm going to say African food, and in that category, it's going to be different dishes from different African countries. Mm -hmm. So that's a big category, because I do, like my daughter said, I love Ethiopian food. <laughs> and then I'm now loving so many dishes right here from Burundi. So yeah, that's going to have to be Ooh, uh, I think about that. Right there, Mukeke. Yeah, because mm -hmm. yeah, you can't forget Mukeke. That's, it, that's a whole other category. So that's why I said African food, because there's different dishes that I really, really love. Mm -hmm. Think about that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, it's still my top 10. That's why I wanted to put the soul food in Jamaican, like, in one category. <laughs> but, like, right neck and neck. Oh, oh. So that would be like, there. So I would have an open slot. But, yeah. And what about you? I just want to say this meal, um, zero to 10, I got to give this a 10. This gets a 10 because it was so good. Everything was the right portion. I'm not extremely full, but I'm full. You know, um, I could actually go for some more. We're going to get some samosas to go here for later on. I agree. Yes. I agree. Samosas to go. <laughs> yeah. All right. So um, my top five favorite foods, and they changed. I know with some videos we did back then with top fives. I'm not sure we talked about uh, the top five foods and things of that nature, but um, <clears throat> this is in no order, okay? This is in, in no order. American soul food has to be up there. Um, Caribbean food, I got, and you know what did, what sealed the deal with the Caribbean food? It's probably the same as me. You know what sealed the deal when uh, CB Technologies, yeah. Carlisle, yeah. and Sheena and the family invited us over for them, them oxtails. That sealed the deal, family. Um, I got to go with Indian food because I always love Indian food. Yeah. That chicken tikka masala, that's what I always get. Um, I got to have Burundian food up there because they have the mukeke and they got the uh, El Capitan fish, yeah. which I enjoy. We've been eating so much fish here, we haven't even been noticing. Like, I don't even realize. We, me and my wife was talking the other day. We like, you know what? We been eating fish almost every day. I'm like, where we do that at? Where we do that at? Yeah. Um, so I got to put this up there. Um, and Tanzania food, you know, Rwanda food. They have their own dishes and everything, you know. But I got to highlight the Mukeke and the El Capitan. And that fish we had the other day, the float, uh, Joe, Joe food. No. I, the name is in Lake Doga Doga. That fish, the fish that only uh, lives in Lake Doga Doga. That fish is good as well. Um, all right, that's three, four. That's four. My fifth. I forget. I forget. But my fifth favorite cultural dish um, or food. I might have to say. Yeah, we're finished, boss. I'm gonna have to say, um, <laughs> American Chinese. I gotta go with American Chinese food. Cause we grew up eating that. I mean, let's take away. As unhealthy as it probably is. <laughs> and I know people turn their face up. American Chinese, yes. Hallelujah. 
because General So Chicken mm. has a special place in my spirit. Yes, General So Chicken, General So Shrimp. Shrimp. Oh my goodness. But they gotta cook it right though. If it's cooked right, yes. Mm -hmm. Orange chicken, orange man, chicken. you got the damn chicken. wrong. Honey chicken, orange chicken. Lo mein. Shrimp fried rice, yeah. Yeah, the lo mein, yeah, the way they do that. There's quite a few dishes, yeah. And it's only in America, like, where they, where they, where they cook that at. Because in China, you're not going to find that. So, yes, those are my top five yes. culture dishes. Um, notable mentions. Oh. Thai food. Yes. Um, is Cambodian food. The chicken and ginger is so healthy. And I could eat that every day. I could eat that every day. Chicken ginger, yes. Um, and I also like Italian food, like pizza. <clears throat> hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I almost forgot one. Thing. Yeah. Mexican food. Ooh, I'm gonna have to redo my list. I'm gonna have to redo my list. I'm gonna have to redo my list. I'm sorry. I'm forgetting a lot here today. I'm gonna have to redo my list. Uh, but anyway, this food was good. I definitely yeah. recommend this restaurant. Um, Paparazzi and Bujan Buddha. Barundi, definitely check this out. If you want to try some good Indian food, if you yes. don't like Indian food, come here, try it, check it out, get some samosas. They even have burgers and pieces here. Nice food, nice place. Yeah. Yeah. He gets a 10 for me. That's a 10. Yes. Yeah. Mm. Without a doubt, a 10. Yeah. Everything is good. And, and then when you throw in the view, like it's yeah. beautiful. Like, ah. Yeah. The view. Nice. Very nice. So yeah, my nose itch. So yeah, <clears throat> that was definitely a 10, probably an 11, because oh, everything was good. <laughs> <laughs> the customer service was good. They listened, like they really listened. Like I, I love when people listen, <laughs> even though I may not listen to my parents all the time. That's not the point here. <laughs> all right. <laughs> like I asked for medium spice, he asked for uh, small spice. When I tasted his, it had that small spice. When I tasted mine, it was medium. They listen. Hallelujah. So that was good. That was good. Definitely. So yes, come here and check out paparazzi. Yeah. All right, fam. So Ayla says she wants to redo her list. You got good foods up there. But yours was I, but you don't eat that. It's up. I don't eat American. I haven't had American Chinese in like four years, yeah. and that's still up there. So, <laughs> or soul food, and that's always gonna be up there. So I'm glad you said that. So we got Amer this is my top five. I ain't gonna do order. They're just there. <clears throat> Cause I forgot how they do the onions here in Burundi when they put them on like French fries. That's something different. Yeah. They marinate them onions and something. I don't know what they did. They know what they're doing. Yeah. Anyways, so first, all right, we have soul food, of course, American Chinese Caribbean. Then we have. Is this in the order? Or are you just saying? No, I'm just saying these. Oh, all right. There's three. <laughs> <laughs> then we got. Mm, this is. I don't know if I can fit this in five. In five. <laughs> yeah. It had to be like a 10, top 10. <clears throat> what you trying to throw in there? Italian and Mexican. Yeah, Italian. See, hey, Boom Baby, you forgot about uh, El Forno and all these places. I know, but I haven't I've had that in a it while. I'm matter. thinking about the stuff I've eaten like so <laughs> much more recently. Um, Those will go in probably my top 7 to 10. Yeah. Right, I'm going to have to do a 7 or something. Yeah. I'm going to have to do a 7 or something. Because, yes, and like I just said too, Burundi food got to go in there. Is that mukeke? And the way they do their onions, even how even your side salads are good. I've never been somewhere where the side salad is actually good. Like you actually want to eat know. the it's side salad. Like, yeah. It's usually like dry, yeah, or the or the um the dressing is like what is this? Or it's just olive oil dressing, like, and it's like what is this? But they put time into the side salad. They really like make a dressing for it. They uh, season it. They know what they're doing. So yes, brown beef food got to go in there. Definitely. That's that. That's yes. So that's a that's my top six, seven, seven. American. Yes. Cool. Yeah. Yeah, family. So we thank. <laughs> we thank y'all for um, all your love and support. We thank y'all for watching this video. 
we thank y'all for uh, just always being there when we come on. You know, uh, we get a lot of comments. We get some good feedback and things like that. And we appreciate each and every last one of y'all. Y'all who are subscribers, members, we love, appreciate you. Even if you ain't subscribed, but you watch our videos, we appreciate that as well, family. That's right. And we don't pop jet no mask. And we don't pop jet Nomadic. Nomadic. All right, family. Peace. So many places we go and we taste food and we're wondering who's the chef. So we just had a delicious dynamite meal here at um, this restaurant and we got a chance to meet the chef of paparazzi. Yes. Yes. Yeah, I'm really glad to, uh, to see you here and I'm very happy to uh, enjoy the food. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right. The food is very good. Yes. Yeah. We just want to tell you in person, your food is amazing. It's delicious. Thank you so much. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Yeah. Thank you, sir. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>